guys, Rob Murphy from Holistic Healing Choices here. Now today, we're having a look at the app Breeze. So Breeze is an app that tracks your mood, gives you little tests to find out more about yourself, as well as having access to specialists and a whole bunch more, like games and everything else. So it's another one that looks to help you and assist you with your mental health and direction in life. But is it any good? Let's jump in and have a look. Okay, so I haven't used it for a couple of days and this is our home screen. This is what we come into, so you can see. You've got a little bit about what the weather's like because it is actually a sunny day out here. Your mood tracking. Now, this is what we've got here. I'm feeling pretty loved. And you've got a whole bunch of things here and about how you feel. And then it's gonna take you to those areas. So if I'm unhappy, it's gonna show those ones. So the design is really good, really clear, really simple. Um, let's just go next. Now at 8.56 in the morning, and i am been working. Been sleeping, I've been working out, so I don't know where the gym is there, but anyway. And you can add a comment there as well, done. So that's our mood tracking, done. Now, as you can see here, it is very easy, nice, bright, colorful in the design. So the UI is really, really good, really simple, really easy to use. You've got your journal up there. Now you can do tests all about different things. So here we've got career guidance. I don't know why it's got this one for me. Are you practical? Yes. Athletic? Yes. Straightforward? Yes. <sighs> yes. Well, yes, these are all... Anyway, you get the picture. So you can go through and get some career advice for 99 odd questions. Yes, I am sure. But here too, once you complete a test, it colors up this little bit here. So the tests are just a way to help you get, a, get an understanding of yourself. So if we go back to my mild mood disturbance, on this one, personality test, ISTJ, which is wrong, because obviously somewhere I picked something that obscured the results because I'm an ISTP. Uh, and you can retake the test as well. But it gives you like top activities for yourself, and you can let a specialist analyze your results. And we're not going there. <laughs> and it's got some more insights for you. So it's very insightful. So the content of it is pretty good. And the amount of, so you've got 15 odd tests here for that sort of thing. Now you've got a game here too, flower chain, which is quite easy. You get your flowers to explode and then try and link other ones to them. Just a simple, mindful little exercise to help you along. Exit. That one. Now you can get a specialist. And I mean, it's nice, easy, clear. You know where you're going to. There's no hidden extras here. Now the cost of this app isn't too bad. Where are we? That we haven't got that. As well, for what you're getting. Now you've got your courses as well. So, why we feel sad. I can retake the course here, because I've done this one. Yep, cool, yep. And then a little quiz, when you want some drama, which is a wrong answer there. Yay, know your enemy. So you get all these little quizzes here, and then it pushes you along to the next logical step with those as well. We get out of those, but you've got a whole bunch so it's your standard affair of using this as well. Scroll down, scroll across to find what you need. And all your tests. So most popular ones, and your mental state. Once again, the down and across sort of thing to find what you're looking for, and away you go. And at any time, in the middle there, you can check your mood. So while not having a whole bunch in meditation and things like that, there is a lot here to sort of help you get to know yourself better, which puts it into a different category, I would say, than most of the other apps that we use. But really, that is about it. You've got all sorts of different tests and everything else to help you gain some insight about yourself. So you get all that for about $9.50 a week, which isn't actually that bad. Really, that's like the price of two moderate coffees, if you're looking at it that way. And that's you know, I normally have a coffee every day, so there's about $25 a week out there. So you can easily afford that if you're looking for that thing to help you get to know yourself better. 
I wouldn't find much use out of it because I know myself pretty well. I've done a lot of self-development work, but for someone stepping into this for the first time, this would be a great sort of way. And you get that seven day free trial to see if it's for you. And it's easy to use, very easy to use. Is it always correct? I'm not sure. You really would have to sit down and analyze, take some actual time with the test rather than just zooming through, missing the point. But all up, I enjoyed it a bit. I would give Breeze a seven out of 10. Not as useful for someone like myself, someone who works in the field and does a lot on myself all the time, but it is a highly capable app to let you get an introduction to yourself. Find out where you would be suited going, your emotional intelligence, internet addiction sort of stuff as well in there with those tests, as well as plenty of courses for you to gain a little bit of insight as to why you're feeling the way that you do. But that's Breeze. Have you used it? Would you use it? Leave a comment down below. And remember guys to like, share, comment, subscribe on this video, and I'll see you in the next video.